Hey guys, it's Luke here and welcome back to another video. And you join me today with yet another Cupra K1 on the channel. It's always a pleasure to film one of these cars and this one is certainly no exception. It's a stage three car running a hybrid turbo, of course, a fully forged engine, and it's also a bit of a track spec example. So a bit of me, I love a good track spec car. Of course, in usual fashion, we are joined today with the owner of the car, Perry. So we'll get him on camera, introduce him very shortly. Uh, he'll give us a bit of a walk around, what he's done to it before we go out on this 450 brake, fully forged, track spec Cooper K1. Okay, so we're joined now with Perry, the owner of the car, mate. Thank you so much for coming down no on the channel today with this. I love a K1. I think everyone knows that. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe one day I'll own one, but track spec yeah. example as well. Yeah, stage absolutely. three. Yeah, stage three. Hybrid turbo. So yeah, Hybrid recipe turbo, yeah. for a lot of fun. Yeah. So what we'll do, we'll dive straight in. Of course, yeah. things we've got the bonnet open. Yeah. Uh, plenty to talk about really. Yeah. Um, everywhere. So yeah, if it's all right to, to give us a yeah, bit of yeah, run through, that'd be great. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So it's a fully forged BWJ engine. Mm -hmm. um, that's the car. That's the engine that came with the car originally. Okay. Uh, it's built by AKS. Okay, yep. Um, it's got a Venom 430 turbo. It's mapped by Artec Stage 3. It's yep. got a Revo induction kit. It's got a Supertech valve train. Oh yeah, the core packs. The core the packs at yeah. the top there, yep. Yeah. Um, so it's got ZRP rods, ARP head studs, mm -hmm. AR, ARP cam cradle bolts. Sorry, it's got a welly intercooler with hard pipe oh, kit. Yeah. That's um, a pretty go-to. Yeah, it's like kind of the generic go-to, but uh, you can have like a custom kit made, basically. Yeah. Um, it's got a fully built gearbox. Okay, wow. BC coilovers with adjustable top mounts. Yeah. It's got Brembo 18Z calipers with 350 mil discs by yeah. EBC. Just up front, yeah. Obviously. Yeah. Team Dynamics as well. Yeah, Team Dynamic 1.2s. Yeah. Moving around though, first thing I spy is a very similar wing on this <laughs> to my Golf R MGC wing. Yeah. Of course, same company who did mine. Yeah, They're got, really cool to be fair. Yeah, it's got a, it's got an adjustable blade on it as well. Yeah. Like you can adjust it with a tool. Exactly. Yeah, you've got um, huge amount. But it does it does it. make a difference. It does. Um, it does it generally like does. It the car down to the ground yeah, at higher time. speeds. Big time. It's not really great for like motorway digs to be honest. Yeah. It slows you down. Yeah, but, that's true. Yeah, yeah, that's a good point. That's but, a good um, point. No, it is it is good fun. Yeah, absolutely. Diff wise, have you got a Limited yeah, slip in it yeah, as well, yeah. Limited slip diff, uh, built to the it's on the built gearbox. Uh, yeah. It's a quaff limited slip diff. Got a lot of work's gone into this then, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It's got a um it's got a four inch uh downpipe into three inch downswept yeah. cat back. Uh, it's all custom. Cool. Yeah. Tick yeah. welded. I think you're running meth. Yeah, as well, it's running you, yeah? it's running a full meth kit. Uh, it's not meth dependent. Yeah. Um, it's got a 25 litre tank in the back. It makes no difference to power, it's just a cooling aid. Exactly, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, Perfect idea for a track car really yeah, yeah. it's got um a ttrs uh clutch okay yes of course yeah, yeah didn't think of the clutch, clutch yeah, yeah. and flywheel uh, which is a great bit of kit i mean yeah. the car's running 440 foot pounds yeah and it's got absolutely no dramas with yeah. that at all yeah yeah awesome stuff but i think the main thing with these cars is just how fun they are out on the road yeah yeah so i think uh if that's pretty much everything yeah we I'll, should I'll... <laughs> get it started up yeah, absolutely <laughs> and yeah. go for some fun yeah 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 Club Sport on Instagram and he went bring the car to me, I'll fit it for free and I'll do it in an hour and a half. Oh wow. I was 
like right. done. <laughs> you know, um, and he could do it in any colour, any yeah. colour I wanted. Uh, so so like a half cage. Yeah, yeah I'm just going to put up a uh, half cage. It's FIA approved cage. I suppose it's not a show cage. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But, um, yeah rear cage, uh, future plans, uh, maybe a cool works H pack shifter. Oh, definitely. Yeah, yeah just to make it a little bit more well race car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, race car. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I've got a couple of mates that have had like, you know, CAE and yep. the work shifters in the yep. past and the, like, the throws are just so yeah. nice. And it's higher as well, so it will sit back. Yeah, yeah. so it's closest yeah. to the steering wheel. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, Talk about steering wheel. Yeah, so code after uh, code aftermarket steering wheel. Yeah. It is good, it's, I like the feel of it. Yeah. Please make sure you leave a like and make sure to subscribe for all the adventures. Stop.